Long Islanders flock to the shore this summer, Hofstra University is helping beachgoers, including myself, learn the basics of rip current safety before they get in the water. It's surprising how little some people do know about beach safety and rip currents. Researchers are swapping the traditional classroom setting for this brand new virtual reality equipment, immersing the user into an ocean simulation. The person wearing the goggles becoming the swimmer. I think it's definitely helpful for people to know because you never know what situation you're ever going to be in. And just those little tips could really save your life one day. Now, according to the United States Life Saving Association, rip currents kill more than 100 people nationwide every single year and also accounts for more than 80% of lifeguard rescues. Experts say, well, the main reason for that is not knowing how to get out of one. The rip current themselves actually will not pull you under. But what might happen is, especially if you're a weaker swimmer or you get very nervous and scared, you'll fight the rip current, try to go back towards shore. But as we learned in the simulation, the correct way to safely navigate out of a rip current is by swimming parallel to shore. I think that's very important and that some people, you know, they need to learn it because some people aren't good swimmers and it's dangerous. Hofstra University received $11,000 towards the purchase of two sets of virtual reality equipment through the New York Sea Grant program. Professors hoping it'll grasp the attention of the younger generation and bring more awareness to beach safety. Reporting in Point Lookout, Briella Tomasetti, Fox 5 News.